Hi, welcome back to Dynamic Song Performance Skills. I'm Pepper J. For over 30 years, I've been a performance coach in Los Angeles, California. I've coached actors, singers, public speakers, anyone required to be in front of an audience. In this video article, let's explore how song performance skills are developed. In general, there are three steps. Number one, learn your craft, the specific techniques that will make you better. Number two, explore your inner universe. Find what's easy for you to do. And three, and most importantly, enjoy the process. In our last webisode, we introduced you to your song performance skill toolbox. Click on the toolbox link to download and print one. It's your list of basic song performance skills. With this list, you can begin to identify your strengths and your weaknesses in each skill category. As you better your own skills, revise your list as you turn weaknesses into strong and confident skills. Then, it's time to go to work. First, learn your craft. Like anything else worth learning, song performance skills takes practice. Practice often. Put in the time and effort necessary, not just to be good, but to be excellent. Wow them. We suggest a regular schedule or routine, a special time for you and your craft. Yes, anyone can set up at a party and sing some lyrics, but very few can truly entertain. Include yourself among the few. Learn your craft. Number two, explore your inner universe. You are capable of becoming a better performer than you ever imagined. Let loose of the person you are and transform yourself into you, the singer. Remember, what is appropriate and expected of you as a performer would probably get you fired from a real day job. What makes an audience want to return to see you sing over and over again? Certainly not the person we are at work as a waitress, lawyer, or taxi driver, no. Audiences become loyal fans because the performer from your inner universe excites them and frees them from their own everyday persona. Whether your style is smooth or animalistic, each time you successfully take your audience on an entertaining voyage, you have shared your inner performance universe with them. What joy to watch, listen, and experience your audience appreciating your singing performance. And number three, enjoy the process. Performance skills are best developed through mutual respect between artist and coach and between artist and audience. Add to this mix lots of smiles and laughter and good old fashioned hard work. The result will be the joy of performing. It is much easier to learn quickly if you have a passion for the learning process. How many singers and actors get lost waiting for their big break? They wait to be happy until they've reached their goals, which usually consists of fame and fortune. These goals always seem to evade them, as does their happiness. Have you ever noticed that success comes to happy people? Now, would you rather share your space with a happy person or a sad person? Coincidence? We think not. Enjoy your craft. Enjoy the singing, the learning, the rehearsing, and most of all, enjoy your audiences. Your genuine smile is contagious. Spread it. Now, here's a caveat. Never stop learning or rehearsing. You know, the mistake that we see most often is the artist that feels that they've made it. They think mistakenly so that because They've won a contest or signed with an agent, obtained a recording deal or contracted with a tour. They no longer need to improve their skills. It's sad really. Nothing takes the place of continued learning and growing as an artist. I hope you will join John Ferrari for our next song performance webcast where we explore the key to a successful song performance. And what is that? Believability. I'm Pepper J of the Actors Podcast Network. Enjoy the process and see you on stage.